Right, let's start opening up to stamina up and stuff. Because we got an LMG, and although it's only round 8, you know, we need to start getting our stuff together. And I'm going to go hit the box again. I don't know. I don't want to keep the ray gun because it is absolute garbage packer punched. No, I, I can't. Not yet. I can't bring myself to put away the ray gun. Not yet. I will. Because the pack punch upgrade for me makes it seem even weaker. But I'm not putting it away just yet. You know, this game looks really good for a game that's. I don't even know. Alright, put in the comments because I'm not entirely sure. How old is Black Ops 2 as a game? When did it come out? How old in years is it? Because I want to know. Yeah, I'm interested. Because it still looks really good. So we can get stamina up. Uh, not stamina up. Speed collar. So let us go get it. Yep, you're alive. I'm a terrible singer. I know, I've come to accept it. Die, mate. Look, you're gonna die. Thank you. Oh, hello, you turned into a runner very quickly. Boom! Just a little bit of a, a fun fact for you guys. Oh, here come the hellhounds. Fetch me their swords. Ray gun, do your magic. I'm gonna go camp over here. I love the way they spawn in. It looks so cool. Oh, the ray gun is extremely inaccurate. Ah, spawning behind me, are you mad? Boom. There we go, let's grab this. I've noticed that this is something that YouTubers do a lot. They like switch the weapon twice so it does the weird motion with the gun. I don't know why I'm up here. Um. Yeah, as you were saying, just a bit of fun little context for you. Believe it or not, I'm not really bothered whether you believe it or not, because it's true. I actually came to nearly the last step of completing the Origins Easter Egg. Yes, the first ever Easter Egg with an ending cutscene. The final... Um, the final DLC map of Black Ops 2. I legitimately nearly completed it. And it was only because of a difficulty glitch that made it so that I couldn't do it. Because the stuff that was supposed to be there didn't spawn in. Basically. Right, this is where it starts to get a bit hectic. It's just like, I need to actually concentrate now. Jesus, that got me a lot of points. Oh, made a crawler. That was a bit of a brutal way to kill the crawler, wasn't it? Oh, stupid workbench, why are you not uncovered? Then again, that workbench is used to make the jet gun, which is possibly the worst wonder weapon in the entire world. Kill 
gonna say, can you like please die? Because it's extremely rude for you to just be wandering around without a head like that. Imagine if you did that in public. You just wandering around without a head. You could really freak out some people. Yeah, I nearly completed the Origins Easter egg, basically, and, you know, like, yeah, I'm, I'm not a big Zombies player, I mean, I'm not the Smith Plays, I'm not Mr. T Lectify, I'm not Mr. Dalek JD, but, you know, I consider myself to be quite a good Zombies player, I mean, it's not everyone that can get to the last step of the Origins Easter egg. So I consider myself to be uh, pretty good. Trying not to brag. Like I said, I really do not in any state of mind consider myself to be the best zombies player ever. But, hopefully, when I play Origins, um, I might just play it once to just mess around and everything and then wants to do the easter egg on this channel how crazy would that be a tiny channel like mine actually doing an easter egg on a call of duty zombies map that would be insane i just realized we have nine thousand points nearly ten thousand and nothing to spend it on That's the only problem with maps like this, like, buried, you can put them in the bank. There's no bank on this map, there is on transit, but not on this map. Origins, uh, spin the Wonder Fizz a couple of times, see what you can get. I might buy a double tap. Yeah, let's do it. Could do with some more ammo. We're running a little. Ah! Oh, Jesus Christ, what the hell? Okay, we've got a nuke, that's not what we want. Two nukes, really. So many double power ups, <coughs> it's unreal. Wait a minute. Ha! 800 points! Booyah! Oh, and here come the hellhounds again. Fetch me this. Yeah, buried you can put in the bank. Transit you can put in the bank. Uh, Origins you can spin the Wonder Fizz. Mob of the Dead... Uh, I don't know what you can... I don't know what you can do in Mob of the Dead, if I'm perfectly honest. Just spin the box, I guess, because the weapons you can get in Mob of the Dead are pretty gnarly. I suppose you could use your surplus of points to, uh... I don't know, maybe spin the box and get the Blundergat if you haven't already. Yeah, I make a promise to you guys, when we're going back to Mob of the Dead this time, I swear on my life, we will make uh, the Acid Gat and get the Vitrolic Withering. I did actually, as I said earlier in the video, I did make a series on my channel, which was a secondary Mob of the Dead playthrough, which was called Mob of the Dead um, Road to the Vitrolic Withering or something like that. Which was a series dedicated to making the Vitrolic Withering, which is the Blunder Gat put into the Acid Gat kit and then Pack a Punch. It is the most, and I actually recorded all of it. I just never uploaded all of it, and obviously I'm not going to now because that footage is years old. But when we go back to Mob of the Dead, I will make that because it is the most overpowered wonder weapon I have ever seen ever. Possibly, in my opinion, the best. 
And I know everyone's just like, yeah, but you got the origin staff. Yeah, the origin staffs don't act as portable, explosive monkey bombs that explode nearly on contact. That is something we could buy. I just realised you could buy Galvers. Let's do it. Zap! Okay, it doesn't actually kill them. Well, that was a waste of 6,000 points. Zap! Zap! Okay, so it can two-shot them. Oh, I really don't want to, like, get downed. That'd be not nice. Yep. How did neither of those two die? Yap. 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 Bring it on. Yap. <laughs> I don't really see the point of Galvis being so, like... <laughs> Weak. I mean, round 14, they can't even one shot a zombie. I mean, it's not like. I mean, yeah, it's town and you build up points really quickly when you've got the hammer. But, you, like, on stuff like transit, you're not going to get the Galvers at, like, round 4. Take 6,000 points. You're going to be spending that on box. You're going to be saving up for doors because there's obviously a lot more doors in transit. Like, it all, they need to buff them up. Well, I say they need to. The, this game is obviously not going to get an update, but they should have buffed it up a little bit more. Maybe one shot until, like, round 20. Because that's, like, on transit and stuff, I think that's the kind of rounds that you're going to be getting it for. And otherwise, it's just a bit of a waste. Oh, hello. Welcome to the, uh, the, I don't even know what this is, a bar? Yeah, this is a bar. What is this thing? He... What is it? Oh, I think it's like a cabinet out. Let's not die by admiring the furniture. Oh, I just realised how close you are to running out of ammo. This is not good. See? The ray gun, you saw that. That didn't want you. Look. Oh. Thank you very much. See, the ray gun, not the most powerful one weapon whatsoever. Now, the funny thing was... In, like, throughout the entire of World at War, well, not the entirety of World at War, most of World at War, for the three starting maps of World at War, because, uh, Deris introduced the Wonder Waff, which, <laughs> to this day, remains one of the most amazing weapons ever. Uh, this was kind of the main wonder weapon. I'm just wasting ammo because it's the ray gun. I haven't used my monkeys yet. Try and crawl of this guy. Yeah, look at that. That's how you do it. Yeah, I want to spin the box and get rid of this ray gun. I'm sorry, but you know it's the ray gun. The MTAR, that is a solid choice, but I'm not sure if I want to keep it to pack a punch. I'm going to spin the box until I've got 10,000 points and then. Oh, yay, a sniper. Quick scope. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, okay? I, I'm genuinely sorry. I'm gonna box until... Oh, thanks. Nope. Kill yourself. Bye-bye, Richtofen. No! Stop it. I get to kill you right now, mate. Oh, that is the cringiest sound ever. 